Got some free tail store action for you. Brought over some stuff. Uh, this has been picked clean pretty good. So, uh, brought over a nice batch. Still got some clothes left in here. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven out of fifty, I think. If you've never seen a free tail store video before of mine, um, what I do is I bring stuff here to this storage unit and I uh, just put it in here. It's nice quality stuff, or else it wouldn't be here. At the end of the video, I'll put specific directions to this place off the interstate, off Interstate 49, exit 69. Uh, so at the end of the video, there'll be a clip showing exactly where this place is at. It's about right here or so. Let's get this party started. What do you think? Quartz. I got some quartz rocks here. That'll probably clean up nice. That might look good in someone's uh, garden or something or other. I was going to keep that for myself, but it's probably sellable too. It's got some nice quartz in there. Uh, a lot of that red dirt will probably wash off there. That's some good, that's some pretty good stuff, really. But I was gonna keep this, don't got time. I got a couple little nice little planters, eight dollar tags on each one of those. Nice little guys, got a little dry erase board. It's uh, not in the best of shape, but it's definitely usable for someone. So I'm gonna put that in the garage or somewhere, keep track of something, something or other, you think. It's a good it's a good device to keep track of something or others. Let's see here. There's uh, some little little pieces of information. Drops of water have flown off here and kind of made these signs look kind of junky, so nice tip jar action. I make money off the ad revenue. And uh, a little bit off the tip jar. So I get to give this stuff away for free and still make money. There's a little hologram. I don't know if the GoPro is going to pick that up or not. A little bald eagle hologram, dealy bob. So uh, I'm going to run out of places to put this stuff. I was gonna keep this for myself. It's a it's an autographed photograph of a peace lily. Uh, the frame busted apart, and I uh, just don't want to mess with this. Someone might be able to do something with that. I'll put this guy over here somewhere. I guess we'll leave him like this so people can see it. Um, speakers. Nice little set of speakers here. Little RCAs. I think there's supposed to be four small ones, but there's three anyway. Get that out of here. Okay, here's a whole box of picture frames. I dropped this box and some of them came apart, so be careful in there. Um, some neat, some pretty neat ones in here. That's like a stained glass one there. That's pretty cool. That's probably got some good value to it. Uh, little glow in the dark neon, not neon, uh, little light stick deals. Let's see, Put these guys over here. Box of picture frames. Pretty good stuff in there. Definitely. Some usable stuff in there. So you can have a look at that. There you go. Little kids reading book. Hot and Mifflin. Little kids textbook. I should probably just take that to the library, but oh well. It's here now. 
and this terrarium. I had my turtle in this once upon a time. This is a, this is a nice terrarium. Um, I had it sitting under the stairs in my apartment. And so it's got some leaves and cobwebs and dust in it. But this will clean up really nice. This is a nice one. Um, it's one of these deals where you can put water down here in the bottom six inches. It's for like a tropical terrarium. I actually have a wood lid I custom made for this. I should have should have brought that. But uh, it's pretty slick. So I had my turtle in there for a while. When it was a little smaller. I'll track down the lid for this and I'll drop it off here. If this doesn't disappear right away. You can come up with your own kind of lid. That's nice. Nice little terrarium. And we've got a pair of Nikes here. Nice little kids Nikes. I found this in a video a while back. There was actually a second one of these that I missed. You can see it on video. I wish I had got the second one. It's pretty cool. I like that little guy. Name of name of this place is the Curb, a retail store. I named it the Curb because I used to just put this stuff on the curb somewhere before I rented this out before before my YouTube days. Um, or a lot of it I would just not even bother messing with. But uh, there's one of those little deals. This is one of the best little trucks I've ever found, man. I got this super powerful. I just that's just one little crank. He, he goes so fast that he goes too fast it can't handle. <laughs> it's one of the better ones I ever found. The Grave Digger 4x4 truck. That's definitely a good little toy. And then over here we got prep plastic and leather prep put him over here it's full full can of that whatever that is i don't think this calculator has ever been used if it has it's real clean it almost looks like it just sat in a desk for a long time never was used a little canon p100 dh2 and we got a little kite kite action Stunt diamond, a little stunt kite, 30 inch, one piece. Looks like fun. Hey, it's actually got a little, little stunt type string holder deal. Oh, pretty neat, we think. Ready to fly, tail included. A little string tail. I got a couple kites with me today, I think. Here's a couple of nice brand new notebooks. A little journal book. A little uh, notebook there. Another notebook. Two notebooks, journal book. Uh, nice backpack. Bag Max. Nice little backpack. Think about that. Where? Little monkey pajamas. That's not monkey. a monkey. Yes, yeah, monkey. Okay, I got this little curtain. It's nice, forty inch by seventy two inch. You can do three different styles with it. It's got the curtain rod in the middle. It's brand new, unopened. Versa shade. Parts included. Throw him over here. Sienna. Three style options. One Roman shade. Fishing box by Plano. Plano. It's got five dollar stickers on it. It's nice. Nice, nice, nice stuff. The scale. When I found it, I tried to turn it on. 
and it wouldn't come on and then <laughs> when I went to grab it today tonight see that look at it sucker just came on I hit I bounced something off the top of it and it just started working maybe the batteries are real low and I jiggled the batteries and they made a good connection but, uh, Glass scales. It's got that nice, nice uh, modern, classy look to them. And then uh, this winter coat. It's nice, 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 nice. Weatherproof, 32 degrees, peak performance. It's uh, looking like it might be about a extra large, large to extra large. That's nice. It gets. I noticed it. Attracts dust real easily. Oh, it's coming loose there. It might not be that quality of a coat. Look at that. I didn't notice that. But, uh, actually, shoot. I thought it was brand new. It might be one of them things that will fall apart real quick. But <laughs> Winter's coming pretty soon. Nice little, look at this old red bottle. It's pretty slick. Oh, uh, you know what? That's a fakey, fake fakers. That came from a store. That's not old. Still neat though. I got some other old bottles in here. Nice little shirt by Columbia. It's looking like a, like about a large, maybe maybe a medium. And uh, I've got some lady scissors, piece of quartz. Ooh, broke off there. That's some decent little lady shoes here. Mirabella. Comfort. Size eight. Size eight on those. A little dusty. They clean up nice though. Not bad. Uh, stuff's free. That's always. There's <laughs> always a little added, a little added value to stuff. Yeah, a little earbud container. Here's some more speakers. That's nice. These are nice heavy ones. Um, I noticed when these little speakers are heavy. It usually means they're a little higher quality. I put these over here in the speaker section. What do you think? So, I see like little shelf speakers or something. I don't know if someone can put them to use. They got kind of dusty sitting in storage. But uh, there they are. Nice little bit of wire, like speaker wire. I was almost gonna take that wire for myself. But, well, there's a nice little pink pair of Nikes. Nikes galore. Size. Something. <laughs> they are size something. With that much I'm positive. I can't read that. Seven, Y, something like that. They're not bad. Another little fishing box, a little flambo, flam, boo, little brute. It's nice too. Nice, both those boxes are real nice. Okay, so got some toothpaste here. This did not come from dumpster diving. This was actually bought at a store. I wouldn't put something like that in there if I find it in the garbage. This little four packs of Colgate that was bought at a store off the shelf. Got a little kid's fishing pole. That broken reel needs to come off there. But uh, the pole itself is nice. A little kid's pole. You could almost use that for ice fishing too, I suppose. Not around here though. Okay. Fish pole action. Where's the fish pole go? Not fish pole in a terrarium, I think. A little nativity scene. Throw this guy over here somewhere. I'll put him over here. Makes more sense over here. Okay. Real nice coat. I looked this up when I first found it in the video. I think it was like 50 bucks, 70 bucks or something. I, um, 
I was contemplating selling this on eBay, but uh, let's pump up the views on this video. Putting some nice stuff in here. What do you think? There's that. That's a, well, I guess let's get the name brand on that. Marvin Richards. Uh, Kasab. Joplin, Missouri. I don't know. I think it's I think it's real fur too, so I don't really want to sell that, but it's in existence and someone might as well use it, you know. It's even more disrespectful to throw it in the garbage. Okay, more picture frames. Picture frame action. Nice little look at this little uh little like tool carry dealy thingy majiggy. I think that might be hand uh homemade. Like a little garden type dealy thing here or whatever. Put your stuff in there. And then we got uh check this out right here. Check this out. This is nice. It's like a whole brand new box of uh these imitations. It's nice. Got the cards and the and the envelopes and some stationery down there. It's own little box. That's pretty nice really. So we'll find a happy little home for this guy right here. Okay, now we got a couple little Super Bowl action. Super Balls. What do you think about this? Super Balls. Where can I put these so they won't get loose? How about we put them right here? And then uh, I've got this little, oh, let's get this out here before it spills. Little rock. A rock dealy thingy. That's another thing I was thinking about keeping for myself, but I just <sighs> I've heard it enough times, I suppose. <laughs> just need to get rid of it. And then, uh, yeah, I don't know what's that. Look at that. Pocket guide to facilitation. Whatever that's for. That's a nice little, nice little notebook with a full thing of paper. Someone could probably get some use out of it. It's kind of nice. That's a nice little business type book deal. Or folder organizer thingy. Cool little basket. Someone had potted plants sitting in there, so it's got potted plant dirt. But if you want to use it for something else, it will definitely clean up. But it's nice. It's like a bamboo wicker type dealy thing. Pretty slick. Put that guy right there. Okay, more picture frames. Uh, look at this little, that's like a Christmas ornament. It's a little sparkly high heel shoe. Can't say I found too many of those. Holiday time. $1.97 tag on that. What do you think about that? Put this right here. <laughs> a happy home for that. Whoa. Okay. Giant purple eraser. Not again. <laughs> I don't know if I found an eraser that big before. That'll make someone happy. Now, this is an older bottle, I think. I found these with a, a cat planner that I sold. Someone bought out of my video. The directions to buy stuff out of my videos is down in the description. If you click show more, the description will open up. Scroll down to the bottom. Hey, that's got kind of a mother of pearl glare going to it there. That, that clear bottle. That's kind of neat. It's got kind of a blue oily like tint. Like a mother of pearl type deal in there. That's pretty cool. Uh, the cat planner that I found these bottles here with was like from the 60s, I think. So I'm pretty sure it's got some age to them. That is a cool bottle. It's got a chip right there. It might be, no, it's different chip. That's a cool, oh, hey, it's got a, it's got something on the front there. I don't know if the GoPro can see that. I did not notice that before 
that's got some kind of like some kind of human figure on it like in a I don't know what that like a tree or something what is that what am I looking at there that's an interesting bottle um I wonder if that's got some value to it it's got some kind of it's got some kind of figure it almost looks like an elfish type deal sitting on a you know, big tree or there's a tree I don't know if the GoPro can see that or not. See that? I did not notice that before. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Never have I ever seen a bottle like that. I might have to go home and Google it. <laughs> it's got kind of a gold color up there <clears throat> that's not cracks in the bottle um, it's actually some kind of some kind of paint on the inside oh it's a weird deal hmm I bet that doesn't last long in here okay let's get to it little uh oh, that broke in half shoot there's more to that it's like a little suction cup device to hold people's smartphones, I think. Let's see if I can find that. A couple nice pairs of scissors here. Nice pairs of scissors. Let's see. I've got some kids Adidas. Both these are the same size. Both pairs of these are the same size. Uh, I can't read that. They're small, like for little kids. Nice. Um, little mason jar, little cur. I think there's a wide mouth, if I'm not mistaken. Cur self sealing wide mouth mason. Looks like it's new, modern. Anyway. ceramic painting set have your little kid throw down some watercolors on that little like an owl or a snowman or something fun little dealie it's got its own brush in there too and the paints okay and then we got this little love little love sign love is patient love is kind it does not envy it does not boast it is not proud Hobby Lobby came from Hobby Lobby. Not too shabby. And then I've got a canvas. People like to reuse these canvases. It's not a bad little painting. There's a nice canvas for someone to reuse if they want. Those disappear from here pretty quick. Okay, a little little uh, container for your artificial flowers and whatnot false craft something craft hag craft grant i don't know you can read it when you get here <laughs> uh, running out of space this guy wants to go right back there okay there's another one of those old bottles i found same batch with these two here little holiday decoration that's got Christmas lights in it that's a little square block glass let's put this guy right down here okay let's get this out of here I thought someone would take that for scrap metal but people showing up here must not be scrappers uh, oh, a pair of ladies boots they're not bad Size six, size six on us.
There's another kite. 23 inch little owl. Owl kite, I think. It's got the string included. Some more lamp shades for ceiling fans, or light shades for ceiling fans. These are not disappearing. The first ones I put in here just pretty quick. Nice little lady's wallet. What's that? Little mirror in there. <laughs> this might be totally unused, actually. That might be totally unused. No, it's not unused. I'll take those pictures out of there. I don't want people's pictures in there. But it's nice, though. I'll get that personal stuff out of there. Oh, Spider-Man puzzle. Forty-eight pieces. It says another pair of scissors. And I've got a little finger skateboard for the finger skateboarding wonders out there. And then we got the got the. American Eagle AEO style well, virtual reality viewer thingy majiggy uh, from there I guess okay a couple little coffee cups they're nice there's the other piece of that for the phone or whatever Pretty sure that's unused as well. Okay, and then a uh, little milk crate, not too shabby. And then uh, got this whole little box of these notebooks. I kind of dumped them out, so the ones on top don't look that great, but they're nice. I kept a handful of these for myself. Whole little case of these little notebooks. A lifetime supply of notes in there for someone. <laughs> There's probably a few hundred of those in there. We'll, uh, put them guys back there. And a little electrical tape. <laughs> Picking up some dust and dirt. Electrical tape action. And this came off of an aluminum light. <sighs> Shoot. I had two of them. I thought someone might be able to make a project out of it, but I busted one trying to get it out of the aluminum case. So uh, I don't know if anyone's going to want to do anything with that or not, but we'll give it a chance sitting in here for a while. And let's see, I got this case, a whole, whole shelf full of music here. Just stuffed full of CDs. I didn't go through them all that closely. But it's got like a little, uh, it's got a little stabilizer deal for your, I think it's for your car dashboard. To uh, mount with a suction cup. Probably for, you could probably mount this guy on there actually. Let's see. Something like along them lines. Yeah, there it is. I think it's for your car dashboard. stabilize stuff or stick it stuff but I don't really go through this but it seems like fairly fairly clean stuff so I'll let the last one go through here and decide for themselves but like Taylor Swift and some country and that kind of stuff in here beach boards that kind of stuff and a nice little storage container storage container by itself is nice and uh I guess that brings me to this massive load of CDs. I dropped this whole box, so some of them have fallen out and stuff, but 
all those were actually packed in this one box but now that they're unorganized they don't fit <laughs> but i didn't go through it but it looks like pretty pretty decent stuff nothing, nothing awful or anything so uh just let people go through this uh, just uh, a couple hundred two or three hundred cds all together here maybe These are actually sellable. I mean, of course, the CDs don't have a whole lot of value these days, but we could definitely find a bar for a lot of them, anyway. Maybe some Harry Connick Jr. tape in there. Let's see, I'll we'll just kind of set these over here. Let's You can just come and go through them yourself. You think about that. Last but definitely not least, we've got this stuff here. Nice little purse. This is like for lunch, I think. <laughs> for like a office. Uh, I don't know any, any kind of work type deal. I think you put your your cold drink and your sandwich and stuff in there. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. It appears to be an insulated, insulated uh, lunch cooler disguised as a fashionable little purse. That's pretty slick. And we got some, uh, some kind of Kansas City Royals baseball long sleeve shirt there. And then we've got all kinds of these blue jeans. Those are uh, kid size. Oh no, they're kind of. I think that's young ladies there. Uh, Lee regular fit. Looks like like about a 30, 30 or so along them lines in that ballpark. Smaller stuff. And then this this roll here, I think came off from the same person. One, two, three, four, five pairs of blue jeans. I'm pretty sure from the same individual. Wow, well, that one's definitely smaller. I think there's these four actually. We're all together. Yeah, those four. Size waist 38. Pretty sure on all four of those. 38, 32s. On those four there, and then another smaller, skinny pair. But uh, you can come and check those out if you want. Some nice, nice Levi or some nice blue jeans for sure. Um, that's gonna do it. That's gonna wrap it up. Okay, here comes the directions here at the end. But before I show that, I want to say thank you very much for watching this video. For those of you who are still watching, watching all the way through, that really helps me. Appreciate that. You're the ones making this possible, giving it away for free, and I still get to make money off of it. So let's just win, 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 win all the way around. Uh, not even talking about the fact that this was all, all going to the landfill. <laughs> if you can believe that, isn't that amazing? Some of the stuff all the stuff i mean i put the link to the free tail playlist every free tail video i've made is right down here in the description if you just want to check it out and see from the early days all the stuff that's come through here i also bring stuff in here from time to time in other videos that don't show up in the in the free tail playlist <sighs> dusty so it's even more than the, that playlist shows but I'm just going to leave this sitting the way it is. People should be able to walk around it pretty good. A little walkway here. Um, 
Anyways, I got off track. <laughs> sure hope you enjoyed today's show. And as always, thanks for watching. Combination to this will always be down in the description. But it's just locked in the open position. See how it's locked so it doesn't really get anyone's attention. But it's open now. See that? Interstate 49, Johnson Mill Boulevard, exit, exit 69. You're gonna go east on Johnson Mill Boulevard. Johnson Mill. Take a right on Wilkerson at the Easy Mart convenience store. There it is, Johnson Mini Storage. 6004 Wilkerson in Johnson. That's unit number 81. So it's Interstate 49, exit 69, Johnson Mill Boulevard. Hang it right on Main Drive. Hang it right on Wilkerson, 6004 Wilkerson. <laughs>